Rick Sanchez, I've heard a lot about you. <laughs> I've been looking for you, Pharaoh. And I need that Millennium Puzzle to find Prime Rick. You're going to lose Pharaoh. Let's, Let's do it. Sweet. I summon Pickle Rick in attack mode. Next, I'll place two cards face down and end my turn. Why would you summon such a weak monster in attack mode? Why don't you attack me and find out? Careful what you wish for. I play the magic card, Dark Magic Curtain. By paying half of my life points, I'm able to special summon the Dark Magician from my deck. Come forth, my loyal servant! What a waste of life points. Dark Magician! Attack Pickle Rick! Dark Magic Attack! I activate my trap card in a pickle. Whenever Pickle Rick level 1 is attacked, I can sacrifice him to special summon Pickle Rick level 3. Oh, hey there. You know what I like to do after a long day of beating up bad guys? Beat up some more bad guys on Raid Shadow Legends. This game is huge, like 80 million players huge. Yeah, best part is, it's free. See, I'm a sucker for fantasy, so this is right in my lane. You can choose from all kinds of champions, like 650 of them. You can pick whatever suits your taste. Personally, I like to go with the elves. They're pretty hot. You know how it is, man. Hey, gorgeous, how you doing? You know me, I'm a man of visuals. And for a phone game, these graphics are crazy. Just look at the polygons on those things. Damn. You get to go in an epic quest in dungeons taking on bosses for treasure and glory. And if player versus player is more your thing, it's got you covered with arena mode. Now look, you don't want to be the same as the next guy or girl, which is why there are literally billions of ways to mix, match, customize, and build your champion. And look, I'm all about keeping it fresh. That's one of the things I really like about Raid. They bring out new champions and updates every month. So there you have it. Rewards and rivalry, artifacts and arenas, immortals and imps, dungeons and... You get the idea. I got a question. Who's crazy enough to give away gifts when it's their birthday? I'll tell you who. Raid Shadow Legends. Happy birthday, Raid. Look, in celebrating its fourth anniversary, you'll be getting dedicated offers, free gifts, promo codes, events, and a brand new fusion event where you guys get your hands on the anniversary-themed legendary champion. Heroes, you have been summoned. Glory and honor awaits. Use the link in my description or scan my QR code to claim your treasures. And the epic champion, Kalan the Shrike. Your monster is still not strong enough. Dark Magician, proceed. I need to vet Morty's mind blowers. This gives Pickle Rick memories of his assassin days. Now he remembers some serious kung fu. This increases Pickle Rick's attack power by 1500 until the end of this turn. Oh no! Attacking me with your Dark Magician was a mistake, Pharaoh. Thanks to my magic card, my monster is stronger. That's what happens when you f with Pickle Rick. That was Capoeira, not Kung Fu. Rick, this duel is far from over. I have my faith in the heart of the cards. Oh yeah, did you? Perhaps it's time I teach you some manners. I activate the magic card double summon, allowing me to normal summon twice in the same turn. Because of the dark magic curtain card I played, the monsters can only be set face down. Put yourself there, didn't you? The Dark Magician Girl is the key to my next combo. I set one monster face down, and immediately tribute it to set another. This guy clearly doesn't know my special ability. I set one card face down, and end my turn. You should just give me the Millennium Puzzle now and save yourself from humiliation. Rick, you underestimate me. You will regret it. I activate the equipped magic card, Laser Cannon. This gives Pickle Rick an extra 1,000 attack points. With Laser Cannon, the special effect activates. If he attacks a monster in defense position, its defense becomes zero. Pickle Rick, attack his face down card. I activate the trap card, Mirror Force. Shit. Oh yeah. I 
need to summon my Egyptian god card and finish off the rest of his life points. Your style of dueling is cheap, Pharaoh. Rick, maybe if you weren't so drunk, you would have seen my Mirror Force trap card coming. <laughs> Whatever. I activate the continuous magic card, the Seeks Box. This is a Me Seeks Box. Let me show you how it works. You press this. I'm Mr. Me Seeks. Look at me. What kind of creature is this? Mr. Me Seeks has three abilities, and I can use one of them once per turn by paying 1,000 life points. Mr. Me Seeks, draw three cards from my deck. Let me try something. Sweet. What are his other two abilities? Rick, tell me. You'll just have to find out the hard way, Pharaoh. I play the magic card, Portal X Machina. By discarding one card in my graveyard, I can add one magic card from my deck to my hand. I discard my weak goblin. I choose the magic card, Portal Roborn. By paying half of my life points, bring back the weak goblin I just discarded. When we go in, a special summon from the graveyard is effect activates. Let's be special summon another one from my deck. He must be planning to summon his god card. The look on your face says it all. You are about to the bricks. Next, I play the magic card Ancient Chant. It lets me at the Winged Dragon of Rob from my deck to my hand. And thanks to Ancient Chant, I get one extra tribute summon. So you think you can wield the power of an Egyptian god? F yeah. You're meddling with forces beyond your comprehension. I'm a genius. Nothing is beyond my comprehension. I normal summon Gronklamite. Next, I will tribute all three of my monsters to summon the Winged Dragon of Rock. Oh, yeah! Almighty, protector of the sun and sky, I beg of thee, please eat my cry. Transform thyself from orb of light and bring me victory in this fight. I beseech thee, grace our humble game, but first I shall call out the name of the Winged Dragon of the Rock. Stare into the face of defeat, Pharaoh. I have to summon the most powerful Egyptian god. Rick, every monster has its weakness. Even your winged dragon of Ra. There is only one card in my deck that can defeat Ra. Part of the cards. Guide me. Pharaoh, I've seen worlds you wouldn't even dream of. I know the true secrets of the winged dragon of Ra. I take no heed in trusting the words of a drunk. See for yourself. I activate the field magic card. The lay of the sun god. On this sacred shrine, Rock gains 500 attack points at the end of every turn. I sense energies of the Shadow Realm within it. Rick, where did you find this card? If I told you, you wouldn't believe it. And one more thing, once per turn you have to flip a coin. If you call it wrong, you discard one card. If you call it right, you lose 500 life points. Heads or tails, Pharaoh? It'll be heads. I choose heads. You got lucky this time. Lucky isn't quite the word I would use. I thought you would have figured it out, Pharaoh. This has become a shadow game. Your move, attempt. How does he know my name? My move, I draw. I activate the magic card, Pot of Green. This allows me to draw two cards. Perfect. Now it's time to reveal yourself. Come forth, Dark Magician Girl. Pathetic. Next, I play the magic card, Sage Stone. When Dark Magician Girl is on the field, it allows me to special summon the Dark Magician! This face again. Now I set one card face down and activate the Magic Card Monster Reborn. And I choose to bring back my Kuribo! Why would anyone put that in their deck? Rick, you made a grave mistake by dueling me in this shadow game! Now watch as I summon one of Duel Monster's most powerful creatures. I sacrifice all three of my monsters to summon Slifer the Sky Dragon! Come, my mighty beast! Behold my Egyptian god! One card means 1,000 attack points. Is that the best you got? Not quite! I activate Card of Sanctity! This card allows us both to draw until we have six cards in our hands. This takes Slifer's attack points up to 6,000! I hate to burst your bubble, but it's time for Valet of the Sun God's effect. I'd like to see you get lucky twice. Heads or tails? Heads! It's as though my life energy is fading. 
What's wrong, Rick? Not the result you wanted. Just make your move. And now I leave it to destiny. I set one card face down and end my turn. I need to thank you, Pharaoh. Your card of sanctity gave me the exact card I need to crush Slight for the Sky Dragon. I activate the magic card, an eye for an eye. <laughs> what is this? This is how it works. I discard cards to my graveyard, and you have to discard the same number of cards that I discard. That's for a thousand fewer attack points for Slifer. Now your Egyptian god pales in comparison to mine. What was that you said? Every monster has its weakness? Every monster does indeed have its weakness, which is why I came equipped with this trap card. Disgraceful charity! Every card that was discarded by a magic card this turn is returned to the player's hand. Now my Sky Dragon's strength returns! You're not out of this yet. I still have one more chance to weaken Slifer. I activate Valley of the Sun God's effect. Heads or tails? Heads! What the f is going on? I won't lose this duel! I'll take you down! You won't beat me. I have come too far. That puzzle will be mine! I'll remind you again. You are dealing with powers beyond your comprehension. Boy, I can't wait to send your superstitious ass to the Shadow Realm. You'll regret it. You need to finish him now before he pulls out another combo. He's probably going to use his face down card to increase Slifer's attack. Either way, it's a gamble. I'll just have to give myself the best odds. I activate the magic card, Plumbus. This gives me an extra 1,000 life points. It's showtime. Here it comes. Rock! Obliterate Slifer! Blaze Cannon! Not so fast! I activate the trap card, Reckless Greed. This lets me draw two cards, increasing Slider's attack points to 7,000. Slifer, destroy Raw! Thunder Force! Dad, I activate Meeseeks Box. I'm Mr. Meeseeks, look at me! Mr. Meeseeks is going to roll a die. Whatever number it lands on gets multiplied by 200. That number is added to the attack points of Rock. If I roll three or higher, I win. There is only a 33% chance of you winning. The odds are in my favor. Good luck, Rick. Roll now. Ooh, okay. Slifer. Rock. Thunder Blink Force. Shadow game, Rick. Once it's begun, there is no escape. Slifer, show him what true power is all about. Attack! It won't hold much longer. Okay.